Hey, what is up, everybody? So I just want to like apologize real quick. The audio quality is not going to be that good. I'm literally recording this on my phone. But if the audio quality is good, then give me some credit, all right? But I just kind of want to quickly talk about some Galaxy S9 rumors that are going on. But before I even get into that, I just want to say I'm doing the Xbox One giveaway still. So in order to enter, just add me on all the social networks and subscribe to the channel and you are entered. I'll probably pick a winner in like a month or so. But yeah, that's enough of that. So the S9 is pretty much going to keep the same body for the most part. Apparently, the front bezels are going to be a little thinner. But honestly, I don't think it's going to be that big of a deal. Uh, some people are saying that the corners of the screen are actually going to be more so flat flat like the note 8's design more so than the galaxy 8's round corners at the top and bottom but i guess we'll kind of see what happens hopefully they go for the flat kind of thing i kind of like that a little bit more like what the note 8 has the best thing about the s9 though the fingerprint sensor is going to be moved from the top by the camera to actually the bottom of the camera and actually i from the renders and stuff it kind of still seems like it's still like right next to the camera but at least it's at the bottom i would prefer kind of like what the google pixel does where it's like in the middle of the phone on the back but even if it is up by the camera at least it's down on the bottom rather than the side of it and apparently the cameras on the back on the s what i'm thinking of is the s9 the regular version there's going to be a single camera on the back and with the s9 plus there's going to be two cameras kind of like what the note 8 has um that's kind of what i see them doing kind of to make you know the s9 plus you know kind of something people will go for more rather than the s9 and like I said before, there's probably going to be two variants, the S9 and the S9 Plus. The S9 will have somewhere around a 5.7 inch screen and the S9 Plus will have somewhere around a 6.2 inch screen. That's kind of a huge difference, but I mean, they're both going to be amazing phones. And obviously AMOLED screens on both, but I would expect the same resolution from the S8 coming to the S9. And this wasn't really talked about a lot, but I kind of expect like a better face unlock feature to rival the iPhone X's face ID. But at this point, who knows? Like, I mean, I still prefer the fingerprint sensor over face ID. So I'm kind of curious on what Samsung's going to do there. A couple other rumors are stating that the S9 will have six gigabytes of RAM, which is a crazy amount, as well as a possible octa-core processor on this phone which is going to be insane i mean you know six gigabytes is already a lot and we're adding an octa-core process this phone's going to be able to handle whatever you throw at it and that's kind of the main rumors that are going around now i mean at the end of it this phone will probably be the fastest android phone ever when it's released so i can't wait until it's officially launched like it's going to be i mean the renders and everything are making it look like it's going to be like unbelievable and yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Let me know if there's any other rumors you guys want to see talked about probably in future videos. I'll probably have an updated one in like a month or two. Apparently, it's going to come out in like around March. It's definitely not being released in January. So and yeah, guys, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, make sure you subscribe and enter the Xbox One giveaway. You know, add me on all the social networks, stuff like that. But more importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. And hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.